If you do not have a business where you are selling high ticket products, services, consulting, coaching, and package it up, promote it, position it, price it in a high ticket manner, then make a commitment to figure out how to do this this year and the next. Why do you want to sell high ticket products, digital courses, coaching, consulting this year and beyond? Hi, my name is Shakir Hussain. I'm the founder of Funnels.com. I generated over $30 million before I turned 30 years old. I know what I'm talking about when it comes to selling high ticket products and services. And this just past week that just went by, my business generated over $120,000 in sales for ourselves. And the reason why I wanted to share this with you is because I was just having a conversation with someone who was super smart, super intelligent, you know, had a lot of different degrees and they didn't understand this concept of high ticket marketing, right? This high ticket digital courses and whatnot. And really, in this year and the next, so 2024, even 2025, you could push it till then, but really in the next 12 to 24 months, you really want to position yourself with a lot of cash, a lot of cash in your bank. So I've been around a lot of rich people, from people like Richard Branson to Tony Robbins. And let me tell you, one of the things that happened when I was at Tony Robbins Mastermind event, which is like a $75,000 per person event, I remember him getting on stage and saying something like, winter is coming. And I was like, man, I came here to be motivated and jazzed up. And why is this Tony Robbins dude telling me, Winter is coming, recession is coming. Like, what the heck does that even mean? And I remember very clearly at the time, I was thinking to myself, okay, this guy seems a little bit off the rocker. I know he's off the rocker anyway, but let's just say he, he really sounded like he's off the rocker. But now you see recession signs, unemployment all over the world, all this crazy stuff. And I remember back in 2009, when I started internet marketing, I was around 21 years old. I used to do low ticket stuff. So I used to try to sell for stuff for like $37, $97, $100 here and there. And it was such a hard graft. Like I just remember it was just painful. And then when I came across this concept of high ticket marketing, essentially selling results focused, high output, transformation driven courses, coaching, consulting programs, where someone is paying you for a specific result. So if I just said to you, hey, I'm gonna help anyone and everyone generate leads. What does that even mean? generate leads, get traffic. I'll help you get traffic from Instagram. Slaying. Here's how you craft a million dollar marketing message. I help CEOs or seven figure entrepreneurs create an extra 50 to 100 qualified booked calls per month. That, that offer sticks way more than, I help you generate leads. I help you generate leads. I help you get more traffic on Instagram. No one cares about those things. And the people that care are usually not the ideal target market that's gonna pay you a premium amount of money. In one of my brands, in one of my offers, we have this offer that is, hey, give me 90 days and I'll show you how to get to 10 to 30 high ticket clients every single month. So basically 10 clients at 5K a pop is basically 50 grand a month. Bottom line is this, it's focused on a specific outcome, okay? One of my clients is a health Guy. He's got maybe 120,000 followers on Instagram, all organic, doesn't really do much paid ads. And his whole thing is, I'm gonna help you shred like 20 pounds of weight without essentially killing yourself doing cardio, right? Very specific, boom, boom, boom. And he only focuses on entrepreneurs and CEOs. So he's not looking to help just any Tom, Dick and Harry because I think he charges like 12 grand for his program on helping men shred weight, get into shape. The reason why I'm sharing high ticket information if you don't have a lot of cash flow, then you do not want to waste and spend time focusing on the low end of your market. In every single market, there's always a group of people that are hyper responsive buyers. The premium clients, they like to spend money. They want to spend money. They have money. And instead of you trying to sell your gadget, your gimmick, your information program, your course, your passion, whatever, 50, 100 bucks, if you start to ask yourself, hey, how can I charge a thousand, five thousand, $10,000, $50,000 for my products and services? And how can I deliver a 5X, 10X, 20X value and outcome that people would flock to come to us? So I've been selling different products and services. My own mastermind is $50,000. I've had around 220, 230 people join that mastermind. Why do they pay this? They pay because they want a specific end outcome that I can help them achieve. Why can I help them achieve that? Very simple, because I spent years of my life developing high income producing skills. 
such as copywriting, funnel building, learning how to do webinars, how to speak on stage, how to craft million dollar offers, how to do live events, how to do affiliate programs, how to scale to seven figures, eight figures, multiple eight figures and beyond. And so what I share this with you is to remind you and to myself that, hey, recession is coming. If you're not focused on serving a group of people, serve the high ticket end of the marketplace. Now, once you have X amount of cash saved up in the bank, whatever, and now you want to okay, go back and some of my friends in the industry, they're launching these, you're going to see this $7, $27 per month membership site, you know? And one of the reasons they're doing this is because they want to build as many buyers as possible so that they have a community of people that they can sell to over and over again. But here's the thing, if you don't have, you know, 50K, 200K, 500K, a million dollars cash saved, stashed away for yourself and your family to protect your loved ones and to have a cash buffer during this winter time that we're coming into, you know, I'd, I'd strongly recommend make that your fo core focus, right? And maybe your goal is to get to $5 million cash. Like, who cares? Focus on what will make you happy. And I can tell you 95% of the time when I'm speaking to clients, it's basically you want more money, you want more cash in the bank. So focus on high ticket clients, focus on delivering a premium service, charging a premium price, delivering a premium service so that they can get results and they can now refer others, obviously do a great job with them. So now they can refer other people and when they refer other people, now your business becomes a marketing flywheel. So your ad spend goes down and now you can literally get customers for free. You can get customers because Word of mouth is strong because you have a great product. Some of my core programs are so good that we, I don't even need to advertise. People literally, I just had a lady from Dallas, Texas, literally say to me, I've just heard about you and your programs and I wanna join your inner circle. How much is it? I said $50,000, boom. One wire, clean and simple. And, and this happens over and over again. One of the clients never ever, ever, ever heard of me within a few days of getting to know what we do boom, comes in, sends like $51,000 for a consulting program. Now, this is him just buying information, right? So what's the profit margin on something like this? So if you do not have a business where you are selling high ticket products, services, consulting, coaching, where you're able to take your experience, expertise, your life passions and package it up, promote it, position it, price it in a high ticket manner, then Make a commitment to figure out how to do this. And if you want my help and my team's help, make sure you subscribe to these YouTube videos because I'm going to be making more videos like this. And I'll see you in the next video.